Today, digital giving plays a key role in a church's stewardship ministry. Without sound protections in place to protect digital gifts, there is a greater potential for fraud than in relation to physical offerings. Let's start by understanding the three processes included in all e-giving setups. First, there is a giving platform. This is the system used by the church to collect credit card information and bank account information of its donors. Second is the payment processor, also known as the merchant account provider. This system processes the gifts by receiving, verifying, and accepting or declining credit card transactions on behalf of the church. Third is the giver management system. After the gift is made, there must be some form of recording and management. While some giving platforms have the option of processing giving records, most churches host giving records on their own IT systems. Once the church has these three processes properly established, it is important to implement strong internal controls. Here are the four steps to help establish internal controls vital to security and digital giving. First, build a strong multi-person payment processor relationship. While one person must initially establish an account with each payment processor, multiple staff should verify the initial setup. Second, limit authorized changes to the payment processor accounts. Once the payment processor relationship is established, changes to the account routing number should be limited to senior church staff, none of whom participate in the reconciliation of digital funds or have access to the giver management system. Third, Reconcile digital giving accounts regularly. It is essential to reconcile bank accounts and giving records to payment processor transaction reports and giving records to bank accounts. The person doing the reconciliations should not be the same person in charge of the payment processor relationship and the giving management system. Fourth, limit access to giving systems. Heighten security by limiting access to the giving platform, payment processors, and the giving management system. Having extra eyes on the giving data by allowing donors to access giving records online through a secure system and by mailing periodic giving statements can also help ensure gifts are properly posted to giving records. Establishing and maintaining God-honoring digital giving for the church is not easy. Finding the right balance between trusting your staff and verifying their work is important. High accountability in the digital giving arrangement protects your staff and demonstrates sound stewardship of God's resources. You can learn more about avoiding digital fraud by checking out these resources on our website at ecfa.church resources. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more finance, governance, and fundraising news and insights for your church or ministry.